Hello beautiful people, hope you're having an amazing day. You are a start, don't let any mofo dim your light. Today I'm gonna to show you a push routine that you can implement into your calisthenics workout, or your fitness routine, your exercise regime. If you wanna tone that upper body. A um, uh, little bit of update. So today I'm gonna to go to Officeworks to check out um, some canvases because I may wanna create some awesome gallery images for to share with you, um, just to brighten up your living space a bit. So we're gonna check out and see if they're vegan as well because I know that some inks are inorganic and they may use animal products. So we're just gonna double check with that. But more importantly, we got ourselves a garden growing. Okay, so uh, cabbage, red and, or red, <laughs> purple and the regular cabbage. Some carrots, spinach and a bit of kale. So looking forward to that harvest in the future and then i think what's mum's done here mum's just uh, got rid of all the old plants and we're going to put some new ones as well more kale um that's already been grown and plant a bit more other seeds as well so we're just going to head towards office works and we're going to go check out and test out some canvas prints because i'd like to you know something that i've been wanting to do for so long is to is to uh, yeah print some canvas images for my bedroom and also just possibly and possibly share that with you guys if you're ever interested um, you know, just to add a bit more life to your to your feng shui to your room flow okay so let's get moving let's go and check out office works and then we'll go to the park and do a workout there and we might go to the gym. We'll just see how, how much we can get done at the uh, park. But yeah, let's go. Office works. Yeah, so if you don't know, I've had a background of photography. I used to be an event photographer um, for like 21st birthdays, 18th. Um, some, some music festivals, a uh, little bit of some weddings, gauger parties, you know, just big celebrations. And um, yeah, essentially that kind of just, I just let it go because I got over just the narcissistic side to it um, and just, just kind of outgrown it and I really needed some change so I just kind of let that go and then focused on building a personal training business. Um, but yeah, today I just want to go back, explore a, a different avenue of source income and that's through, you know, prints, uh, canvas prints. and. And if this works out, I mean, this could also just show you that you can do it too, whether you have whatever talent that you might have, um, because I know photography is one big passion of mine. Um, and that, that it could also work for you and show you that what's possible. So, um, yeah, that's a bit of a bit of my background with uh, photography. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Be sure to check out the... Uh, not too sure what we want to call this, the LSD tribe or the LSD community um, lifestyle dynamics on Facebook. Um, so that way we can create a team of like-minded individuals and help encourage, help each other grow, help each other evolve, you know, share our stories, be heard, feel seen, and just grow as grow as one, you know, um, that's what we're here for. We're here, to, we're here to help each other evolve and we're here to you know, push ourselves beyond our mental limitations, okay? It's part of the process, part of the journey. So check that out, check it out on Facebook, Lifestyle Dynamics. Let's keep on, let's keep going. Now I remember what I wanted to share. Today is the 21st of June. Um, it's the, I think it's one of the shortest days this year and it is also uh, in in Sydney um, and it is also the ring of fire so today we might be expecting a lunar eclipse that happens once a year I'm keen to see if we might experience that um, in this part of the world but yeah looking forward to that maybe get a shot if possible without you know <laughs> um, destroying my eyes but let's see let's see how we go so Alright, water done. Water day um, 12 by 13. 
was it 12 by 30 inches wasn't too sure about the ink i did ask whether it was inorganic or not um the box didn't say regarding whether it was vegan or not but um i'll dig deeper and see if the make was actually vegan should be ready in about two days so keen to see how that turns out all right so we've just arrived at the park i tried to do some research couldn't find whether or not there were animal-based products in the specific cart uh, ink cartridge uh, ink cartridges um so yeah if you guys know whether some ink cartridges are vegan or not or if you know any vegan friendly ones please uh, let us know that will be super helpful and also just make people more aware of you know how these things are produced so we're at the park now it's a fucking gorgeous gorgeous day we're gonna get to warm up some push-ups and then get into a push routine let's go Of those, two each. I'm gonna get the shoulders warmed up nice and moving freely before we put ourselves in more intense movements. So, yeah, just a bit of a tip for you before you ever do your workouts. Do some very, very uh, beginner style exercise or just warm up to your shoulders because we don't want anyone getting hurt around here. So, let's go, let's get into it. That's really you guys, just four rounds of those. So four sets each. And you got yourself a really super intense push workout to help improve your shape, keep your mind full of happy hormones and just enjoy the day out here, outside. So um, I'll show you guys what I have for my post workout and for dinner as well. If that interests you in learning about what I eat to stay in shape, Let's go. Now, a lot of you might know that I do like to intermittent fast, okay? So basically, I follow an eating pattern, um, either 16-8 method or one meal a day. Um, these days, I'm usually just having a shake with some snacks sometimes and then a big meal, massive meal at the end of the day. If you want to learn more about that, I've got a free beginner's fasting guide. Link down below in the bio. Uh, go check it out. There's five different ways. It's an awesome, awesome lifestyle that helps you you know, heal toxic, toxic cells, get rid of toxic cells in the body through a process called autophagy. And essentially, you know, use your body fat as a main source of fuel and really just increase your mental clarity and focus overall. So go check that out, link in the bio. Let's go get a uh, post-workout feed done. It's almost, it's almost time for that eclipse, but I don't think we're gonna experience it because I don't see the moon 
near the sun at all. So anyways, moving on. <laughs> all right, so first thing we're gonna do is walk Zach, and then I'll walk you through what I have for the rest of the day. All right, gotta get in that nature time with my boy Zach out here. Now, let me share with you what I have for the rest of the day without stepping on fucking shite, mate. And this guy tugging me as we talk. Um, so basically, what I'll have now, you'll probably see in the video, as we move into the future, back into the present, because we know it's a gift. So essentially what I have is a shake for post-exercise, okay? Um, don't even just have to exercise, just in general, this shake is amazing. Um, I'll add 200 cups, 200 cups, <laughs> 200 mill milliliters of coconut milk, a piece of banana, okay, a date, hemp seeds, flax seeds, uh, what else? We've got chia seeds, uh, pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, let's go, and some pea protein powder, which you'll see right now. Um, and I'll mix it up usually, either that with some cacao or I'll switch it to berries with some coconut water, make it a bit more like a slushy or a uh, like an acai bowl kind of smoothie. And uh, yeah, that's, that's what I have for my post workout. And then I'll snack usually with some coconut clusters. Okay, so either coconut clusters or some rice cakes. These ones which you're seeing now are pretty freaking awesome um they're amazing they're such a good snack they're such mm, i'm pretty hungry actually it's like almost 2 30 and i still haven't had breakfast i've had like a couple of uh a couple of blocks of uh hazelnut milk organic uh oh they're, they're just so good i used to be allergic to nuts but for some reason i'm, I'm immune to um yeah, to these hazelnuts they're so good they're like nutella oh Anyways, so I'll have that, and then for dinner tonight, what I'm making, as you can see, is uh, basically just a big plate of salad with some leafy greens, capsicum, uh, what else, uh, tofu with some coconut milk stew, that's what it is, uh, with some beans and eggplants, brown rice, quinoa, uh, and I'll either add some um, veggie gyros or whatever other source of protein. I mean, you don't have to get so obsessed with it. Your body naturally produces it through leafy greens, you know, the amino acids that we get from plants. Um, unless you're competing, that's really important. Look at this guy moonwalk. Oh, what a, a show-off. I'm showing off. Nah. Skills, skills, mate, skills. Um, yeah, and that's it. That's basically it. That's all I have. That's I've been doing this for so long now. For a few months, I've been uh, intermittent fasting, OMAD, one meal a day plus a shake. Sometimes, occasionally, I'll have the lunch. I'll have the uh, big meal and um, uh, like a small meal during the daytime. But most of the time, I'm just up and about. It's uh, It's been so good on the pocket. It's been so good on the... Uh, saving money and just saving time and mental clarity this is just my own personal experience to be honest um but yeah like that's 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 all i have for the for yeah that's pretty much you guys um if you enjoyed this video if you want to see more clips like this more vlog vlogging style like this let us know um, I'd love to take you guys out for some adventures, give you some tips on health and fitness, um, nutrition, things of that nature, more of this nature, more awesome sceneries, and just more exciting times. So yeah, that's the end of this video. I hope you have an amazing day. You are a star. Remember to look after, remember to love your friends, your family, okay, the planet, and most importantly, love yourself. We're going to finish this walk and we're going to finish the rest of the day and the rest of this video. Stay well, stay woke. Peace. <laughs>